the third right there, I'm like, I don't know, bro. Like, all of them are too legit. They're too fucking legit, bro. I, the, the, maybe that's the rest of my top five type of third and shit, bro. Like, I don't even know how... Bro, like, they're all so special in different ways. All my favorite rappers are so special in different ways to me, bro. Like, if I'm listening to Nas, I have to be in the mode, like... I'm feeling like mad spiritual. I want to get in, get in tune with myself and shit. Mm-hmm. Putting on mm-hmm. one mic, bro. Hero, I'm putting oh, on yeah. all that shit, bro. It's fucking still mad at front to back. Project Windows. Still mad at front to back, bro. bro. Yeah. Like, Rewind. And that's what I'm saying right now. The that's stories. The stories that Nas tells. The albums that you could just go and just play on and play you can't on skip and on. on. You ain't got to skip there's on. There's not many. Bro, when you're talking about hip hop, there's not, not many. There's not many true And classics. I'm just like, Illmatic is the first thing that popped. Even if you just heard a couple songs, Illmatic. you're like, all right. Yes. There's only one of half a dozen. Yeah, for me. really. Dude, that's yeah. a total skip. Uh, uh, he's not really lying, though, because I'm trying to think. Like, non skips, front to back. For me, like, it's probably that. Flesh of my flesh. Whew. 36 yeah. Chambers is in there? 36 yeah. Chambers is probably yeah, right yeah. behind that. Uh, for me, fuck, paid in full. I might, I might have like that's 10. Tough. I might have, I might have, I might have yeah, 10. Yeah, yeah. I might have 10 perfect albums. I think I could albums. come up with 10, but it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be easy. I it wouldn't be easy. Think. It wouldn't be easy. I think I have 10 perfect albums, though. Nas probably got two of them. Yeah. But what else? Still mad at Still mad Yeah, because that revert, rewind is amazing. Bro, bro, rewind is amazing. It's, 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 it's probably the best storytelling track outside of my dick. Rick. <laughs> yeah. Bro, yeah. Nas, bro, that to me, <laughs> Still mad is his best album, bro. Like, One Mic, bro, Ether. Yeah. yeah. Like, um, I always loved Nas, but I was all like, I thought what Jay did was cute, and I was like, oh, he's going at an actual lyricist. I, I, I actually thought, like, oh, Jay's got some nuts and shit, you know? Nas came back, and I was like, wow, okay. This is, that, that this was is, a mistake. This is for real. I was like, that was a mistake, Jay. I was like, and I think you know that now. And shit. That might be one of the few albums where I think every song could have been a single. Yes, yes. It's still bad, if not the only album like oh, that. Bro. But that just shows you how he, can, just, yeah, he can go across and, the board. And, and it's even better that they've taken off Braveheart part because that was yes. the worst song on the album. That was the worst yes. lyrical song. It was yes. fun, but it was like a D12 song. I'm glad that when on I went back and I, I like, was, listened to it, I was Jones like, Jones on and Horace thing. Like, like take that shit the fuck off there. Take it off. But Wally, ooh. I do Arguably Nas' low point. I fuck with yeah. Uchi It is a great song. But, but it's so stupid and bad, bro. Right? It's bad. His horse's yeah. lyrics was trash. It's mm-hmm. fucked. Yeah. It's bizarre. So crass, bro. It's yeah. bizarre. Yeah. If you go yeah. back in time, this girl's like, turn this shit off right now. I'm canceling this video was right on some now. ill yeah. shit, yo. Like, that shit was wild. Which Eminem album? It's got to be one of them, right? For me, it's probably the Eminem show. Eminem show? show? Yeah. yeah. I just don't think there's a skippable song. If yeah. I had to choose one, it'd probably be Trips. Bro, but are, are, we, are we underrating Marshall Mathers, Mathers LP? LP. Yeah. yeah, are we underrating Marshall Mathers LP, The thing bro? with Marshall Mathers LP, for me, and what takes it that away from that album, up. He was the piece is that it on just that doesn't one, stand the test of time. You don't think so? No. It does for us, but maybe for not for us, everybody else. But if I were to play it for my kid, he's going to listen and be like, who are... Yeah, LFO. Who the fuck is this? Who yeah. the fuck is back to Street Boys? True. Like, whereas Eminem show was more focused on him. True. And his yeah, life. His own person. It's not stuck in a time capsule. I'm not saying it's more important than Marshall Mathers LP. It but could I'm be. For but me, if you had to pick a song to skip off of it, it might be Jerks, but even that song is dope. Yeah. So for me, it's, 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 it's that song, yeah. Tough one. Yeah. But that, that album is his non-skippable album. Okay. It's the most successful album for him, too. Does Jay-Z have two? I believe he does. I think he has one. What? And I think I'm gonna shock you with, with what it is. I bet you can't guess it. What is it? I, I if it's not what I'm thinking. If it's not reasonable doubt. Black album or blueprint. <laughs> well, <laughs> those are all up there for me. But if I had to pick a Jay Z, like if someone's like, you have one album to pick, and that's it. Gun in your head. What Gun is in it? my head. It's American Gangster. I love what? it. What? Uh, don't get me wrong. The live don't band me... on it is what sets it apart for me. It was the cool. live music, bro. Uh, the so roots. You know Nas got shit like that, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, but it's not about, yeah. 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 It's not about yeah. who does it better. Yeah. Yeah. I'm saying for Jay, if I if, if you like put me in front of it, yes. Black Album has zero skips. Yes. Zero skips. Has zero skips. Blueprint 2 is arguably my favorite Jay song. But when I look at it, yeah, Blueprint 1, 2. Yeah. But if I had to take an album that I can just listen to at any time, and just feel a, 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 a tidal wave of emotions front to back, and that's how I re- that's how I view music. American gangster. It's American gangster. I mean, so that album was just beautiful sonically to me. Yeah, the, okay. and, I, and, and I do love the, the fact that it recorded in three days is even more impressive. The beats and st- yeah. Well, it's Jay. He don't There's even. There's one song shit. in there that I could take away, and that's that's the joint with Beans, and I love that song. Yeah, but it, it just don't okay. fit 
the the because it's the one song that doesn't have a live band. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. the one song that don't have a because live band. Beanie don't sound good on the no live exactly. band. <laughs> and it sounds like honestly that song sounds don't like it's probably yeah. I uh, I love Reasonable Doubt, but it just showed the potential. It yeah. showed the potential. Don't get me wrong. When you go back and you appreciate Jay, you're like, this is classic. But yeah. at first, yeah. nobody thought it was. Well, he's right. Let's be yeah. honest. Yeah. Like he nobody thought it was at first. It was definitely lauded, but they're all like, uh, I don't know if this is the thing. Blueprint one, bro. Nine eleven. Yeah, like, to drop it on nine eleven. And like, oh, bro, that's I remember when we took it to the, fabulous. We took it to uh, oh, him, yeah. fabulous, and exhibit restless, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. What a day! What a day what a that was. Fabulous is so underrated, bro. bro. Yes, as a lyricist, yeah. bro. We got uh, what was it? We got Blueprint. Uh, was it Street Dreams Street and Dream. Restless? Yeah, yep. yeah. all on the same work. day. Dude, uh, bro, we could, oh my god, uh, bro. Here's, here's a shock we were in the room all day, bro. Like I got an album for you that has no skips, and it's going to shock you guys. And it's not somebody who I think is, deserves it, or people that I think okay. deserves it, but, but Young Guns, Tough Love has zero skips oh, for me. Zero bro. skips. Love, zero skips. Bro, absolutely no you. skippable songs on that when, album. Chris and Neef. Bro, yeah, that young first guns, album, ooh. Tough Love. Bro, I was into that shit. That bro. album, we was into no that shit. No better love, that yeah, shit. That shit's fucking shit. tough love with denim. Bro, they're they're so grimy. They'll never take me alive with yeah, Jay. Jay Z. Ooh, the joint with Nas. The Cameron. Oh, the Cameron. Oh, bang 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 bang. Oh, bro, that shit was hard. I wow. Said yes, man. That yeah, they they put down song on the right there. So you can understand. That was one of the unknown classics. Yeah, the dips. Yeah, state prop. Yeah, then Jay just has a solo. Yeah. Artist they were there. murdering back that then. That shit was crazy. New York was, was fuck. And was another album that probably has no skips to me, and the only thing that probably could take it off that list for me is the length of the album, but that's probably Purple Haze from Cam. Yeah, it's a long yeah, album. He had a lot of like 36 cameos and, yeah, yeah, and all those skits. But that shit was if fucking you get great, though. It's textbook, dog. Yeah, it's actually yeah. it's a great, great album. A day in the life of Cam and all this shit. Kill it, Cam, Cam, Cam. I'm going to write this song. Yeah. 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 No, it's, it's a way, dog. Yeah. It's a way. Yeah. 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 And the it's features a whole fit. vibe, yeah. bro. The tips had features so weren't going. back, it was a vibe, bro. He had Alchemist Just Plays, bro. Those yeah. beats were... He's got that joint with the, the fucking... I'm going to come out of it. At that time... Down and out. Nobody had yeah. ever served anybody with such good production for a, such a short run, bro. You're talking about Just Blaze, Alchemist, Kanye, bro. He's president They're, of uh, what's the name at the time when he got yeah. all that shit. And then I'm saying another album would be Get Rich Yeah, that snatch. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Get Rich has that. no skips for me. Who? No, Get Rich or Die. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. And that's what I was saying between that, but this shit. What about Guess Who's Back? Yes, Zero back. skips, so but the production good. quality of it takes away from the album. Which one's lyrically better? Probably guess who's back. Guess who's back. Is, but, but the problem is, is that you can tell it was recorded yeah. in like a fucking apartment. Yeah, yeah, you know. Which it makes cheap. it lovable, but and takes away from what it's saying. Bro, uh, it's Wu-Tang grimy to me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That album's classic, bro. It is. Guess For me, the, is the, the problem is if you take away the freestyles off of it, then yeah, zero skips. Mm-hmm. Some of those freestyles kind of uh, like, eh, I, can't, you can't, I can't even listen to them. Something that always just kind of resonated with me is like there's a lot of groups and shit from like New York. You know, your mob beefs and stuff like that. Oh, yeah. But niggas would sleep on cats like Capone and Noriega. Oh, oh, oh yeah. the, yeah. War, the War Report's the probably war, is war, war, yeah. war, I don't like war. Part 2. And war I don't like the, uh, the the reunion that yeah. much. Yeah. The reunion had too many the skits. The invisible, yeah. untouchable CNN. Yeah. That shit was hard. Yeah. Yeah. Body that in the was trunk. Oh, the yeah. trunk. That was nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Bleeding from the mouth. That was tough. That's my that favorite song tough. by then, bro. Oh, my God. But see, that's what I'm saying. You had cats oh, like come nature. Come flame throwing yeah, on nature. Nature. Yeah, nature, motherfucker. Dog, that shit was fucking... Oh, oh AZ's AZ. classy, bro. Wow, bro. I've never understood the hate that he gets. Bro, me neither. I've never understood why Eminem puts him in the bottom If you're five. talking about a prodigy and that comes so from a rapper, AZ, him, compared to Nas, is the only one that stands up to any of the, this is my prodigy and I'm a great rapper. AZ is the only Predecessor. one that yeah. makes sense, bro. Another that album man album. kicks that Another shit, that bro. On the me. Firm album. Oh, he kept wow. Up with Bar for bar. Bar for bar. Every time he's with him, bro, he keeps up with Nas. Foxy tried to do her thing, but like those two, Nick, come on. They should, make, they should have their own album, bro. bro. Phone Tap is dope. Phone Tap mm. is amazing. I Phone Tap another is a true story. I think another the other coast would be America. KK America's most, most one. Oh, yeah, I, it's it's hard to listen yeah. to, but I just love that. What album. about Predator? I don't like Predator bro. on that level. Like I, but both those have skippables on, they, on me. Uh, uh, not a lot, though. Not a lot. No, not it's a like lot. One. Lethal Injection got a lot of skips? No, no Predator. No, I'm, I'm not saying, saying they have a lot. I'm, I'm saying say, one that's... skip each for me, America's most one. It was like, yeah. hmm. I'm sweating. This is, this is that for me, another album, Public Enemy. 
Um, nice. The first joint, oh, like, zero skippable for okay. me. Okay. It, it, that's hard to listen to. But the only reason, reason but, that, but Dead Press has a classic album. You ain't got no choice but to bang that out, though, because hey. I was part of that Let's time. Let's get free by Dead yeah. Press. Hey. Probably hey. One of what what do you guys oh. think about this? Has there ever been one-offs? You, you, this happens, bro, one-offs. These albums just come out, smack your life, and the artist turns into trash, right? Yeah, that's Nelly's it. quick. Nelly, MGK, right? Yeah. You remember how they came out, bro? Like... Nelly was the big country one. grammar. Ooh, Wiz with, with, too. With, yeah, Wiz. Well, well, Wiz I, just kind of dawned off on his. I own. fuck with Wiz. He's come back. His, but yeah. the his crowd ain't the rough, same. Bro. Yeah. The initial fall. He's with Amber Rose. Like, yeah. Bro, the initial fall off you, you're, rough. bro, do you remember the initial following of Wiz? Everybody's yeah. like, oh, I'm on that jet life and shit. Yeah, I'm like, bro, yeah. he's got like three songs out. Calm down yeah, and shit. Bro. Yo, Cushion Orange Juice. A little shit. Oh, that so was Cabin classic. Fever? That's Great. a classic Great. album. Great. Cushion Orange Great. Juice. Cabin yeah. Fever was a classic. That's uh, more of a modern uh, day classic. Uh, yeah. Uh, How many modern day classics are there, do you think? Of course they don't stand up to the We're talking about modern day classics. Some of them do. Maybe one or two from this generation. And I'm going to say this generation going back to 2010, maybe? 10, 10 I would yeah. say Trump Music. Trump Music say, by Yellow Wolf? I would say wow. Good yeah. Kid, Mad City. Say, good yeah, Kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. And then I, I really, I just fucking What's love it. What's uh, ASAP's first album? I love I was just going to say that. I was like, that ASAP album is a fucking amazing, amazing piece of fucking music. Amazing. The musicality of that album. Just straight, yeah. back, straight New York, bro. Yeah. Special, as soon as I heard Flores and the I was like, oh, I was like, the yeah. last great posse cut? Yes, yeah. right? It's that like Wu Tang. It's like Wu Tang, bro. That shit's a thank banger, you for Ferg ASAP, by the way. And thank both of you Ooh. for not being with Schoolboy Q probably has a, a fucking modern day classic. That <laughs> think so? I love that new album by him, bro. Oh, like, I haven't heard it. Okay, I haven't introduced it. I fuck with Q hard, but I never. He think... never lives up to his potential. I get yeah. that, but this album does. It's, it's, okay. it's a little not cohesive because he's doing. Himself, mm -hmm. but fuck the album on a whole. I, I think it might be a minor. Do you think right? like Cali rappers hold a torch, bro? This is always the stigma and shit. Like uh, Cali rappers, they ain't lyrical. They don't got the chops to keep up with what's going on West and East Coast and shit. Do you think that it's true and shit? You guys yeah. fuck with Vince Staples they're, they're, and shit. I fuck with Vince Heavy, bro. They're, they're no, lyrical bro, rappers like, in the West, but they're few and far between. I believe their that music is, is more based around the vibe and the culture. vibe, right? No, right, it's baby. based around that time. So you, let's talk well, about like, like I, Too Short and Ice T, bro. Well, yeah, but yeah, that's, that's a vibe too. Yeah. That's a vibe. And then as and it just goes, for me. I don't understand the Nipsey Hustle love. I respect. He's a skilled lyricist for sure. He's a dope rapper. Okay. I'm not a West Coast dude, bro. So the the, the vibe I that I get from that. it, I can respect it, but it's not my vibe. It's yeah. not it's not something I don't understand. So it's the same thing I told you about Dolph. Mm -hmm. I get Dolph's allure, mm -hmm. but I started listening to him late. I can't. I get it, but I ain't that. You got, yeah, you you'll never hear me being like Dolph's top five. If you listen, that's genuine to me. If you listen, he make a lot of songs about getting money and how. Yeah, I'm exactly. And that's how he put a whole lot. Of no, for sure, and shit. for sure. For sure. So like, I, I wasn't there for the movement. Yeah, 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 more than I was there for the Nipsey movement. So Nipsey, for me, I get it. I, I definitely fuck with Nipsey. Definitely, but um, it's basic. Their rhyme schemes are very A B A B A B A B. Whereas. You know, East Coast is more lyrical. The vibes, right. there are lyrical right. artists out of the West Coast, but to say game is a lyrical artist is disingenuous to me. Whoa. <laughs> you, don't think, you don't think the game is a lyricist? He's a lyricist. He's not a top tier or even mid tier lyricist. Out of, out of the West? Out of, out of the West, yes, but I'm saying on the grand scheme of You don't think, no, nah, bro. On the grand scheme, no, no, he's wait, a beast. Wait a minute, wait a minute. No, no, no. I, I, gotta just, I gotta disagree a little. Bro, Game's been on tracks with New York Cats and yes. shit. And he's I'm had no more I'm not I'm saying he's rapping, right? Yes. I'm not, but you, you misunderstood. I, I, I'm not defining it by who he is with other artists. I'm defining it by who he is as himself. Solo artist. You want to know something funny? You wanna Solo artist is how I define everybody. He yeah, that's, that's, that's he did murder Jay Z on Renegade. Oh yeah, but that's an old Eminem. <laughs> I am the. I'm gonna, I'm gonna raise, raise my hand up right here, right now. But Jay didn't it, lose by that much. It, it, he, it, the fact that he got murked on his own track, dog. It looks bad, but it's MJ. Okay. But more so. All you Jay hip hop fire. If you're a real hip hop hip hop head, you already heard this song. If you're not, look up Renegade by Jay Z and Eminem. Tell me who had the better verse. I am of the minority, bro. Jay Z took me on a fucking ride on that song, bro. Long time ago. Like, Long time ago. Oh, yeah. I think. Yeah. I, Here's the thing. I think Jay Z is the better rapper on that song than Eminem, bro. But I really do. It's, it's M, and it's like, here I am. This was M's. Jay's oh, version this was M's right over. That was that the was last M. spot. Yeah. Right there. And that's where he took that, it. That and then was from there, there was the, nothing. Bombing on the sweater. Yeah, yeah. There right. was nothing, bro. That's, that's the I difference guess. between old school Eminem and new school Eminem. Post relapse, his rhyme scheme is very basic. There's multi syllables, but they're peppered with. Bullshit, nonsense. nonsense metaphors. Yeah, 
pre relapse Eminem is unfuck with a boy. Oh man, on a track that with man anybody was, else. He was God. And that's how he I was compare, really Godzilla. Back and that's then, how I bro. compare artists. He was you, really that Joe is dope when he gets on a track with other yeah, artists, yeah. bro. That fool fucking puts on. He's never had the worst verse when he's on a song with Bust or J or yeah, anybody. I feel, but by himself, but by himself, I can't put him that. And that's how I feel about Game. Game steps up when he's got competition. Mm-hmm. But Game ain't Exhibit. If we're talking top tier lyricists out the West, Exhibit is a top tier lyricist. X to the Z is, is a top tier lyricist. Me, for me, me, Tech Nine, bro. Tech, tech Nine Midwest. Tech Nine, bro. He's Midwest, and he's a top tier lyricist. He's that's tough. Eminem. Tech Nine is a machine. Machine, bro. bro. But if we're talking about pure lyricism, that's why I don't back to that regard. Yeah, yeah. When we're talking about you in the West. Really North Pole. Oh. I, I knew uh, I went to high school with his brother out here, bro. He was nice though. He, he was was a, what did he sign a death jam for a little bit? He was signed up for the Circle of Peace. Yeah, he was signed up for the Circle of Peace. Yeah, okay. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What the other dude from the Circle of Peace? Let him get off like that, though. No, Juice. No, Juice was Busta Rhymes. The fuck was No, Juice was the game after he started beefing with the dude. It's my fuck. What was his name? Uh, I don't know. Arizona rappers. Do, uh, look. I used to. Man, who was that? Oh, not, he's, look, he's, he's, Arizona rappers. Up. All I can tell y'all is get famous. Hot Rod. Hot Rod. Hot Rod. Yeah, Hot Rod. Yeah, 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 he wasn't yeah. that thing. Yeah, yeah Willie North Pole's DTP. There we go. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, yeah, fucking, yeah. yeah. I met yes. Willie out here a couple of times. My thing is, when you look at it, if I'm taking lyricists by coast, the East Coast washes the West overall. And I'm sorry. Thank you. But if we're talking about the West Coast is a five, bro. But, and that's what I'm saying. When West I look, Coast when I look is, at the game, is a musical vibe, but East Coast game is a lyricist on the West Coast, and he does step up when he faces. I mean, other but, that, but does that sway game's a decision? Lyric, but well, if I'm taking it, all coast, but, Ice Cube, whatever, I'm always going to pick. But you say your game. number one was X, right? Who was your one? Yeah, X, 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 exactly. But uh, does that sway a decision that the East is super beasty compared to no, the West? Because, absolutely. Because X is your main guy. It does to an extent, but also I listen to everything. Do there are dope lyricists on the West Coast. I'm saying that you feel that that's a heavy bias because I'm a Nas dude, dog. Yeah. And I'm over here like, I, I we guess, created that shit and they put the gangster in it when it went west. It's, yeah, I can say that it's a bias, but I've given the West Coast those chances. I mm-hmm. think that's And a, I would be willing to listen to anybody. With so right now, if like you that. put in your top I tier lyricists from California, who you throwing at whoever that um, who is on the East right now? So you throwing Kendrick. Let's say you're going to throw Kendrick. Yeah. I'm throwing the game. East Coast. Game, Exhibit. Game, game Kendrick, Exhibit, Kendrick, Ice then, Cube. Ice Cube. Okay. And then after that, the list is... I mean, it's, I it's, say, a, it's a toss-up after that. Let's just be honest. Yeah, let's be honest. But when you go to the East... You got motherfuckers who ain't even came out with music. You got a laundry list, yeah. So East Coast is too tough, bro, because that's the birthplace of hip-hop. Yes, I agree. And and I think they take it a little bit more serious. And that's why New York's falling off, because New York doesn't have an identity anymore. There's not everybody everybody out there. there. Everybody want to be the Everybody wants to chase the South and chase the West. They don't want to be united, but they also don't have an identity sonically. Like, that's why I love Griselda. I thought yeah, Griselda was going to bring that back. Yeah. Identity back. Yeah. But it just didn't catch the way that I wanted it to. Griselda, but boys are dope. when you look Shout at it, Benny. New yeah. York has a sound, and that's the problem with New York not being popular anymore is why Texas is taking over, why the South is taking over, why the West is taking over is because yeah, sure they're individual out. sounds. Yeah. It's a sound. Yep, yep, yeah, yeah. You yeah. couldn't put an artist in front of me and go, where, what coast is from, and not have me predict it. Yeah, you know, yeah. Unless yeah. it's from New York. And yo, we're in the middle of our hip hop app. Yo, uh, just a little uh, quick uh, interruption, real quick, if you want to call it that. Yo, DWG, we're highly involved with anything humankind, yo. Mm-hmm. Like, we want everybody to be straight when they go home and, you know, wake up to a good morning and shit. But the reality of it is, is we can't always do that and shit. Tragedies strike everybody and shit. We got a link in our podcast today for somebody that we know. I'm not going to get into detail, but if you guys are watching out there, yo, if you can, send a little money their way. They went through a tragedy. You can read about it on the GoFundMe. You know, either way, if we touch you guys at all out there, you got to know that we don't, we joke a lot about a lot of shit, bro. But at the end of the day, we want humankind and people to be peaceful. We want love and all that shit in the world, you know, so... Mm -hmm. If you got any sort of human kindness in you, or, you know, if you can give a little, give to it. If you uh, consider yourselves a fan of the DWG boys, we do the same for y'all. You shout us out. You know what I mean? We want everybody to be part of our community. So hit the link and shit if you guys want to. Donate. You know what I mean? We would highly appreciate it. Mm-hmm. This person is in a, they're in dire straits. You know what I mean? And they'll take any help that they could get. So, you know, on a serious tip, you know, uh, if you can give, you know, it's hard times right now. If you can't, at least throw a little love. You know, we'll always still love y'all. But, you know, 
be human to your next human, you know? There's something that's missing in this country, in this world nowadays, bro, and I'm sick of it. We got this election and all this shit coming up, and mm -hmm. what does it do? It divides people, divides yeah, it people, yeah. divides it's people. the highest pinnacle, too, bro. And it's fucked up. Like, uh, it could divide your neighbors from each other. It makes a little mini civil war just for opinions that might slightly defer. You got to remember, at the end of the day, we all come out the same hole and go into the same one at the end of the day. You know what I mean? So... There ain't no difference between any of us. So thank y'all for your time and shit, but let's get back into hip hop. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, Just yeah, while yeah. we got a little bit of time, you know what I mean? Thank y'all for uh, having that little listen. So like, you guys think like, if the coast, they're dividing, we got Midwest, East Coast, South and Who's shit. Who's really dominating it all is like the... Everybody's had their run, you mm -hmm. know what I mean? Um, like shit. on the rise again, like I, New York just isn't, everything's just splat. The boroughs ain't, Brooklyn, Queens, Staten, Long mm -hmm. Island, and the Bronx. And even the East other states from the East, they seem a little divided. It's not fair right now, bro. Hip-hop <laughs> is not what it used to be, right? Right now, the only thing up and coming is the new wave of Texas. Right, right? right. yeah, yeah. Right. you know, yeah. hip-hop big, 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 big extra, extra plug. Big mm. yeah. OT and all well, I can't boys, say man. like as far as like, uh, cream. Listen, yeah. what's my man name? God damn, NLE the NLE Chop. Yeah, man, he Memphis all day. Yes, I fucks with NLE. He's wild. He's wild. Yeah, he's crazy. I fuck with him, but he's crazy. He's fun. Yeah, he's fun to me. He's fun. Yeah, he seems like I can go to a party with him and shit. I'm like, I'm gonna get into trouble tonight if I go with you, but I kind of want to do it. My dude is wild, bro. Seems like he can talk me into some shit, you know what I mean? I fuck with him, though. That pistol packet is a banger. I don't care what anybody yo, says. Yo, okay, so I said Jay-Z got Eminem on Renegade. You guys may disagree and shit. What are some controversial verses you ever see? Who got who on what? Who got who Sorry. on what? Are it, who? There's a lot. Who are some of the best guest artists? That, they'll Bun come, B, Ludacris. Yeah, you know. Andre 3000. Andre yeah, 3 Stacks. Yeah, they come they through. They've never just, been undone. They just come through and bless you, and you're like, I'm done. There's, there's my like, 16 bars. You niggas have fun with the rest of the song and shit. You know what, what is I mean? that fucking uh, Throw Some D's remix? Throw Some D's remix. It ain't even nobody's song I can't that. even listen to the rest of the song after three seconds. Andre's stacks, like bro. top five features. Like, oh, bro. bro. He's like him, Ludacris. Back when yeah. Luda was doing his thing, Back old school bro. Luda. Oh, like, my God. He was going to come out of your song and do your song. Yo. Yo. Well, I don't know who I hated when he was guesting on everything. Oh. Weezy. At yeah. first, I liked it, and then I'm like, bro. That guy ran out of shit to talk about. He was wailing on the track, on bro. He was on shit. every fucking could, thing. Every single song was Weezy. That for was crazy. You know who was actually was crazy. who I like as a, a feature artist, and did the ones that he did were huge, but needed to do more was John Rule, bro. Rule has some banger features, he did, bro. He did, he did. Whether it was J-Lo or... Oh, oh shit, he did a show with J-Lo, he did. Those with I'm, I'm, I'm not New against York, Jeffrey Atkins. I'm not against oh, Jeffrey. But yeah, Jeffrey. at the same they, time, a dude, I'm, I'm, I'm queen. You can't buy his first three albums. Hey. They were tough. Hey. Yeah, hey. yeah. Benny Benny yeah. gets you the top five. Non skippable for me. Yeah, non skippable. Yeah. Benny Benny well, we're getting true. into this. That's true. Some That's true. true. Those first three albums, they're kind of. That's a run, bro. That's a run. It is. And then Shanti was on the track. Shout out Shanti. She got a baby on the way. They all went like five times platinum after the first one and shit, man. Bro, John Rule was at the Burger yeah. was everywhere between they the were, and him. Cracked that and shit. they were trying to sign Nas. Until that. <laughs> hey, that's a bad. That's a bad. You know how crucial that would have been? That whole joint, that out, that song is. Nah, cold. he did sex on that. Fuck that. I don't like Jay, John Rule's verse, but yeah, Nas, Nas is a nice on that. Yeah, Nas is nice, man. <laughs> Curse a little Earl. <laughs> Curtis, <laughs> Curtis and little Earl. Yeah, man. He, he was bro, mad at that point, bro. Salty. He had D12 on him, 50 uh, Cent, no one, DMX. No, that bro, never, never fell off. Never as close fell as we've off. come to that is what happened to Drake. Everybody dissing Drake. Everybody was. Yeah, when they, Buster Rhymes just jumped, I was like, they just, what? Yeah, just bro. I'm just there. saying, though, bro. You, and then Timberlake's jumping in. And fuck Everybody out, jumped on Drake right now and shit. So, okay. Drake ain't not, so All right, I'm not worried about this. Let's guy. get in. This is some modern day shit for hip hop. This is funny. You know, Kendrick. He, Kendrick and Drake are both our ages and shit. They're in their fucking late 30s <laughs> and shit. So, obviously, we're going to be invested in what they say on the record, right? Because right. we grew up with this hip hop and shit. We're, we're expecting people of their age to know what we know, do yeah. what we do and shit. So Kendrick obviously is um he's he's an alien. You know, we'll call Kendrick an alien, we'll call Drake like a clone. But is a clone bad? Not necessarily. Not necessarily. You know, what if he's a clone of an alien? You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I can mm -hmm. Like, yeah, he can disguise himself like Drake's been throughout every 
Wag Wan Delilah, dog. Wag Wan Delilah. Bro, and Jamaican people are like, hey, hey, Wag Wan Drake. And he's like, ah, okay, hey, thanks, man. Yeah. And, you know, and, and then he, asked, asked he seemed like the nicest guy ever and shit. And he was until somebody had a problem with him comparing himself to him. Kendrick got mad because Drake said he's in the top three and he compared himself, right? Mm-hmm. And then all the shit goes off. Um, look, I'm in agreement with Kendrick. You're not on my level, you know, because when we're here in America where hip hop was invented, hip hop's all over the world now, right? You heard these English niggas, bro? I hate British rap. I, I don't. I don't. I like it. I, I like it a lot. I like, I like like SAS. Yeah, SAS. You like that? Yeah, but I like, I like, I like, like that. I don't like the new shit that. No, that no, no, drill. No, 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 like, you don't like the drill music. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, no, I understand. But, the, but that lyrical, like. There's oh, no, no, But yeah, like no. Central C, I don't care. I don't care. Yeah, Central C. Yeah, no, I don't fucking care. But that's not the like, It's the same scheme in every song. Yo. But that's what. That's their interpretation. Anyone that I like female rappers. But you think about it. That's their interpretation of. No, for sure. Yeah. Same thing with female rappers. That's their interpretation. When they're dope, they're dope. Bro, I'm not going to deny dopeness. This but the true. mainstream thing bothers me because it sucks. Jean Grey's dope. Oh, Remy Ma is dope. Love her. They're, fuck, Snow the Product is pretty dope. I don't Man, like Sexy there's... Red. No. I don't like Wild. No, no, I don't no, like no. Ice Spice. I don't no. want to hear DMX compared to Scarlet. I don't no. get it. Oh, if wow. you compare DMX to anybody, and I will know. come and find and, you. And here's the thing. Just so you know. Unless he's Cardi B is the outlier for me. I don't care. She gets a fucking pass, bro. I'm like a loves Cardi. Cardi. Bro, that okay. laugh is just who she, she is. She doesn't like, look like how she used to no more. She has so much weird, done. I don't know. Don't tell me this. She looks like care. a Muppet. I want to look at old school Cardi B. Okay. Old school. Old school. No. Okay, of the, of the new so I'm going to look at. Well, I want to look at Pink Hair. I'm going to look at old school. Old Jada. Don't Jada, Jada Pink Hair. Uh, what the hell is her name? Lil' Kim, if I was like that. Type. Oh, yeah. No, that, that was you know what I'm saying? Again, the surgery, though. Again, I don't pretend that she exists anymore, dog. But you have to. That's the reality. I refuse to acknowledge that she is a cat's. Actor. All of these That's crazy. female rappers, That's they're, crazy, they're into the freaky deaky, right? They all supposedly like suck like twelve inch cocks and take my dicks in the butt. Deep, my booty I mean, that's what they say uh, by their own account. That's what they say and shit. Who's, who's your favorite one? though? My who's, favorite. Who's your favorite of the new age freaky oh, deaky? You like Meg? I don't. I don't like. Nah, I don't like. I'm her. sorry, I'm Texas. A Cardi B fan. Sorry, she Texas. She's gonna track with Dolph. I'm still I'm not. I'm still. Like it's it. gonna be Cardi B for me. Only. I see myself like she's talking about mainstream. Though. I don't know. Is there underground female rappers? Uh, sure, there are. But I don't know. I don't know them. <laughs> I was like, sure, there are, but I don't know them. Let's not talk about the famous one. Sexy Red. I like Cardi she reminds me of Sexy Red. Ain't coming. Sexy Red is too much for me, dog. Like she is, there's a level. She gonna right cut me. Like, mm, she gonna stab me. She gonna cut me. Yeah. It's stabbing. This, this, this is gonna that end. That bitch beat me up in a club bar. This is gonna <laughs> end with cutting, bro. Like I feel like if if I was like in a bar brawl and she was the only one in front of me, I'm kidding my ass. Yeah, yeah that bitch is gonna handle. Shit, bro. She got the legs. She feel like KD. She definitely with the shit, bro. She She's with the shit. She got the hair weave and all that. Blow. Uh, <laughs> She's dangerous. Look, gorilla. Well, that one was scary too. Uh, no, no. I'll do whatever you want, mama. Because, yeah, yo. Run my pockets. Yo. Blow. If you're out there listening to me, uh, I love you because you're dope and shit. Don't, but me up, don't fuck me up, yo. You, you, yo. You. I love her. She got that Memphis area. Yeah, she, she got the bells on. Yeah, man. bro, man. Yo. Her country ass. Oh, shit. My favorite one out of the new Freaky Deekies is Doja. I'm going Doja with Doja's all day, but that woman is weird. I read an article about her supporting she, white supremacy. She's an alien, bro. Like, what? She's an alien. I just yeah. like the way she looks and like her, it's, her allure. It's, it's yeah. really exotic. And yeah, the allure. It's like, man. I think the weird thing is, like, she did a song. Where she was like a moo cow or something. Yeah, yeah. cow. That's yeah. weird. Oh, she, I never. She I just like she, a demon. Yeah, yeah, she get in the, the, the costumes. She's yeah, artistic, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah she's little. everything Kanye wants to be. <laughs> oh, that's dark. That's <laughs> fucked up. That's a, <laughs> well, that's a, that's a dark fantasy. <laughs> that's the name of the album. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. God damn Great album. Bro. The last girl. Oh, album. how many classics does Kanye have? Kanye's got four Let, classics. Let's get into the band. He's the again. best rapper producer next to Drake. He's the best no, rapper he's the producer best rapper ever. Producer. Bar okay, none. Okay. Because yeah, his hip hop album. He writes his own shit. I like the chronic and shit. His own shit is good. Yeah. I like the chronic. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah.
Bro, I love it chronic, but if any of you motherfuckers out there still believe Dr. Dre wrote it, you believe that Santa Claus is real, nigga. Man. If he's standing next to Snoop on a song, oh then man. Eminem, and then poor little a man named Royce the Five Nine that he fucking Jay Z wrote still Dre. Bro, there you go. Uh, look, Dre, I'm sorry. I love your beats. It's you okay. Don't. It's okay. <laughs> You're better than Diddy. You're better than Not Diddy. Not hard. Diddy actually wrote his own. <laughs> And that's why he's better than him. One bing bing, yeah, I mean, back at it, man. <laughs> yeah, like, so we're talking about female rappers. Do something, man. Yeah. yeah. What do female rappers have to do to earn respect? I want them to do one thing, and this is no disrespect to those ladies out there, because dudes have done this forever, right? If you got Uncle Luke and Yin Yang talking about I get my balls licked, you can go and talk about getting your booty hole licked all you want. Yo. Yeah, the criteria doesn't bother me. The criteria right, don't you really want. bother me. But if you're going to rise yeah, above, look. I just said Uncle Luke and Yin Yang, right? They've never said, no offense to the brothers, they don't really profound you and shit, right? Yeah. So, like, I love that these women, I hope it's real respect they're, they're garnering. I'm not yeah, sure what know. it is. I'm not it sure. It feels like it they're is. just riding the wave. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I would want them to, I want a song with content, bro. Like, I don't know if any of these women are relevant five years from now. I want, the I want to know about the block you came from. That's true. That's what I mean. I want to know about the block like, you came Kim from. Like, Little Kim was more than just sex appeal. Yes, you know what I mean? She, she was some real she, from the streets. Yes. Yes. Put Talk your lighters out. Like, like, she, she made hits. Brooklyn. Mm -hmm. All day, bro. It was hits. I That's wanna, what kept her. It wasn't... I want to really know you. Like, even Nicki Minaj had her running. She's a ghost now. Eve. Eve. Yeah. He was another one, a fucking respectable female. I, I fuck with Eve. Actually, she had mad lyrics. And she even and shit. branched off into like pop. Well, she married yeah. like a billionaire. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. She, she got lucky. Now. She was yeah. lucky. She got lucky. Really great she, got life, bro. Yeah. she got lucky. She don't remember. Yeah. Yo, look at you. She got lucky. Yeah, she got an name. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, fuck. Serena Williams. Yeah. yeah. If I married Williams. a billionaire, guess what? I'm ghost too, motherfucker. Yeah. You know what the fuck you talking about? So you can understand why ASAP Man came out with another album, right? It's dropping next week. Dang. What? Is yeah. it a mixtape or is it no, a mixtape or an album? album. It's album. It's album. LP or LP? LP. Or LP. What? LP is hardcore, yeah. This next week or it's August, one of the two. And oh. that's what the main single on it that he just but dropped. But he's been hiding probably. Then. Well, he dropped that That's My Bitch with him and yeah, Rihanna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't yeah. like it, but whatever. Yeah, I didn't And really then he dropped the joint, what, two weeks ago, three weeks ago? That was pretty good. I wasn't on my feet, but I'll look for it. Right is tough. Right is tough. Right going to be yeah. the main. I like how ASAP comes out with a track, and then I'm like, man, come on, bro, right. where the rest of it at? Man, please, please do. Put, a, put Ferg and all everybody else on there. It's though. called Don't Be Done. Stop playing with me, That's his name. His name is called Don't Be Done. I don't know what the release date is, but yeah, it's coming soon. You just see it next week. It says, oh. August 30th, my bad. I was oh, okay. I thought June 30th, August. my bad. Oh, oh shit. That's July. coming up. But yeah, yeah August 30th week, is when it drops. Yeah, all right, man. Weeks, I'm excited, man. All right. I want to hear some content yeah. from this man. That motherfucker been gone for a while. Someone's been gone for a minute. I want to hear what yeah. they've been doing. Yeah. What you been up to, dog? What do you guys <laughs> love about uh, your different coasts and shit? What do they bring to you when you're talking about hip hop flavor? Like, if you go to the Midwest, you're going to hear people machine gunning lyrics. When I hear, things, when I, right? yeah, the Midwest They're going like, to put a whole song into one verse, right? Midwest like, is like double time and fucking. Double time and Midwest. West Coast Coppers, is like bro. chilling. It's like a vibe, bro. But it's also violent. But it's like a violent vibe. It's a vibe. It could be any kind of it vibe. It could be a vibe. Yeah. Thing. But it's when I listen like to the East Coast, it's just straight lyrical. Gutter, grimy, fucking like I feel like these motherfuckers bathe in dirt. They they take you to where <laughs> I think the East takes you to where they're from. It's just yeah. It's the just South like, is good at making you feel. Something. The South the South is good at making. It, I can't I dance. Think that's but jazz. when a Southern fucking joint comes on, I'm like bro, I can dance. It's jazz music. It's good. Bro. It's powerful. The South is jazz. I feel like the beginning of. Uh, yeah. African American music, as you that's heard, right. yeah. yeah, from Southern music. And the shit. South when is a vibe, it but right. it's a. That's what I love about the South. Whereas the East Coast is violent. It's it's a competition. I think the South the West has, Coast is the West Coast vibe. The South like has the, the most South different is, flavors because the East. The South is no unified. Offense, is kind of predicated to New York and Cali. Yeah, there are other rappers, no doubt, but through the South, you got Texas, you got all the way. The South is Canada, massive. Yeah. Georgia, Florida, Florida, you know. And they all got their different little well, slags and shit. Well, what I love about the South is they're all kind of unified. There's beef and shit here and there, but there's a lot of they unity with them. They do fuck with each other throughout, like, and all it's powerful day. to me, knowing that they can do songs. They, they do fuck with each other throughout like, with, the South. Like, I don't I like the T.I. and Ludacris songs, but I hated that they were beefing. <laughs> stop. It bothered me. Stop. <laughs> stop. Yeah, that's, that might be the best diss track ever. Yo, that's, that's a goodie. Those verses are vicious. Man. 
man. Hey, man, not like us is the best. Nah, it's no, not it's the best. Not, it's, it's up there. What is the best diss track of all time? No Vaseline. <laughs> that's, no. that's always where I go. That's a vicious. That's mean. That's no a Vaseline. bully song. That's a bully. I picture him rubbing people's faces in their own pee. Back yeah. down. Yeah. Back down. Really back down with 50 Cent. That's oh, a yeah. bully oh, shit. That's bro. a bully That's when we song. found out his name was Jeffrey. <laughs> if you didn't look it up before then, you like, yo, who the fuck is Jeffrey? Oh, that's John ja Rule. Ja. Rap Devil? No, I'm just kidding. What is yeah. it? Uh, what is it? DMX, he's going at Jay Z. Uh, it was him and Jay the Kiss. You used to be my dog. You was in my Oh, life. yeah. I would say, like, you could be blind if we're talking about diss tracks. Ooh. Supposedly, that's a diss track towards Jay, too. What? No yet. way. I'm going to have to go back and so, listen to that's that. That's what they were talking about on the. Um, was it that, that LeBron show where they're in the barbershop? Yeah, always. Yeah, it's, yeah LeBron, he cool. Just don't anybody on the Yeah, show. yeah. Wow. His son, but, everybody. Yeah, yeah, everybody that shot. Jaden, Jaden, my son. That fucking, that joint, blood that pressure. Uh, blood pressure, that, uh, with him and X. Yeah. I okay. ain't too many Beanie Max. Ugh. Do you love Hit Him Up by Tupac? Nope. No. no. You gotta go get your boys. No. I, I, I like Tupac's energy when yeah, he starts. Yeah, but the rest of the song, but I just don't want to hear. The rest of the song's nothing to me and shit. No, He's nothing and really shit. Know. You gotta go get your boys, bro. Mm -hmm. Do that shit solo. I wanna hear it solo. That's all I'm saying. It's yeah. like when you when you're beefing, I wanna hear it solo. Troublesome ninety six then. Troublesome was so that was tough. Nah, nah, nah. That's my favorite Pac joint. That's my favorite song that Tupac goes off for three minutes after talking shit, even though he had like nine <laughs> of them. That's my favorite one where he ain't even rapping yeah. at the end. He's like to supersede all oh, y'all with mine, cause this is one that really just kind of Fucked everything up over there as a whole. New York as a whole. Okay. Bridges over by KRS One. Oh, Top. yeah, yo, yo, yo. Bridges over. He oh, said Queens oh, was faking it. And, okay. you know, I was in Queens and it's like, okay. oh, what are we going to do? Oh, that's, okay. that's, older, that's hometown shit. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. So, oh, fuck how fucking much older than. I'm oh, sorry. Not God. much. Not, but here's okay. the thing. Yeah. I'm a historian. Yeah. Though, yeah. Baby. No, I'm saying. But like that's Bridge, the thing. Yeah, you listen to me. music, you got to listen to it all, baby. Obviously, Ethan might be the best this track. Oh, Ethan. Ether, yeah. I'll wow. put Ether and the bridge is over. Both Ooh, of them is like this, bro. What about Blueprint 2 by Jay-Z? Jay had his get that back on it, but it's not a whole song. Yeah. It's a verse. It's a verse. Oh, but the verse yeah. is murderous. It is. It is. It's pretty tough. It's murderous, it, bro. It's, it's just, the feel of the whole song. The problem song. Is, is that it came after Jay had already been beat already the got fuck got murdered, up. yes. It was it's like, why not, though? Like, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, Nas kept throwing subs. Yeah, yeah, you got to throw You already know who I'm better than... Come on, the pray for Do you think terrible. that LL that, murder that cannabis? Horrible, though, was... Do you think LL murder cannabis like that? I, I, I think, was... I think yes, in the, I great, in the mainstream, everybody sided with LL, but it, that battle is incredibly close. I could give it to LL, cannabis did his but thing, cannabis bro. did his thing. Did his thing. Did his thing. Did his thing. You don't want me to shine. Oh, oh. Uh, I love that video, bro. Besides it, was great, it was a great style. I like that. I like that. Black, black and white. It was a good beat. Yeah, but the, right. the, the fucking... LL was way harder, dog. Yeah, bro. He was like, he was the march when the pregnancy starts. He was like, percent to... That means LL yeah. just into... That nigga that woke shit. up LL yeah, Jr. Yeah, bro. That's yeah, LL. Yeah. Like, he woke up fucking yeah. had LL with that shit, bro. I'll smash you like a jelly bean. Yo, I don't care. That's my choice. That was hard. That shit was bad. I was yeah, just listening to that on the way over here. I was like, this is so... I want to wear a Kangol hat, but my head's too big. Yo, it's yeah. awful. Yeah, Shout yeah. out LL, -L, man. Yep. Originator. LL's new album's coming out, too. That shit sounds vicious. Yeah, yeah. They, that yeah. passion shit is yeah. fire. Yeah, yeah. it's good tough. features, I heard a little too. Snippet. It's tough. I was... The drum with them is fire. Impressed. I was impressed. That was so slick. Yeah. Impressed. Yeah. Sound like any given Sunday, LL. I respect that. I'm all right with that. I'm all right with that. I shut them down. Hey, what's the best hip-hop You can't hold me. Well, best hip Hip hop sounds hustle and movies. flow. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck out. Out. Yeah, that's number one. Fuck, goddamn. They're better, oh, oh. but there aren't with the original songs. Get rich is tough too. Get rich is tough. Get rich is tough. I say hustle, hustle, and, hustle and flow because oh. hustle and flow is South was gone. Everything. Not, yeah. it, it wasn't great. Where we at? Memphis. Yeah. The Memphis. Yeah. yeah. Whoa, that yeah. trick. Like I said, Whoa, baby. that trick. Yeah. Bro, three six. Three six and all them came through. And they was in the movie too. I never want to see a bag of weed. Haystack three six. Yeah. From see, there's the dude, the convenience store clerk. Yes, that's bro. Yes, that's bro, crazy. No one will ever shit on three six for me for being not lyrical because they wrote all those songs. All those oh, songs. I don't care. No, it I disregards say. everything. All those songs. You can say that they're not. Three six is a term, bro. Talk, bro. Yeah, they, bro. They, they, bro. they are with without the, the South. The boot, bro, by the way, the South is yeah. still there, but yeah, that yeah. sound is three six to me. So oh, heavy, bro. If that's talking if you say Memphis. That's why you like the word you hear is bounce, and all I all I think is juicy and DJ. Yeah, like. That beat, it's like that when I hear sound. Texas, yeah. all I hear is 
Chop and Screw. Yeah, All I hear is Screw and Bumpy's voice. Which I thought it was Chop and Screw for the longest time. And then they like Chopper, that Dolph, that yeah. damn, uh, what's his name? Damn, Key Glock. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Those guys. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You like all that because it's catchy. And you're like, all right, they're talking about money. Netflix, okay, they're talking about money. It's that jazz music, yeah, bro. Yeah, it's, it's, it's such like, a rich vibrancy, bro. You it's don't like even, it's kind of, you, don't you, don't even, jazz. you don't even know what's happening when you just like, yeah, yeah, bro, you just start bouncing. That's why I love Justin Timberlake when he was dipping into hey, the Memphis oh, roots. Shit. That shit's hard. That shit's People forget that he's bro, JT yeah. from Memphis, bro. JT he's is a goonie. that nigga, bro. He's a goonie, bro. I don't even give I've a never fuck. seen a man get more shit on for a DUI in my life, bro. Yeah, they try How to, the fuck y'all shit try on JT it it or his DUI? My watch bro. right here, the inscription says, I wouldn't waste it. That's from the movie In Time because that shit is great. That was a great to just twist somebody's wrist and get some ball I'll harass you for some time. Crazy. Bro, the fact that JT got can- like that's the first man getting canceled over a damn DUI that he didn't even fuck nobody up. Yeah, the, the, the football player in the the hammer hammer lady in the hammer hammer and her dog got fucking less shit for a DUI. How you gonna dude. pull over JT in the Hamptons, nigga? First of all, I'm mad as fuck. Look, I know about white privilege and shit, but this is the fucked up thing. It's yeah. Justin Timberlake. I'm letting you I go, bro. I'm fucking Hamptons, then you're JT. I <laughs> Guess what? Go. Yeah, let me tell you something. If I was a cop and I pulled over fucking Brian McKnight, you know I'm letting him go, too. I wonder what happened to that cop if he might have, like, quit. Oh, yeah, 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 bro. Nigga, if There's you're, certain people I just, you just gotta let go. JT, if you want to get out of the ticket with me first, you're going to get an autograph. Yeah, yeah. Just, just do the little bye, bye 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 dance for me real quick. You can even do the happy yeah. song. Yeah, well, baby yes. got pulled over a few weeks ago, bro. He's like, "Hey man, just give me a ticket, bro." Yeah, he was trying give to get out of there. Like, I got shit on my windows. I don't nobody know who I am. Uh, hey, smart man. Yeah, yeah bro. I love you. He was an asshole. Yeah, he was an asshole. Give me a ticket. He's like, you know what? He's like, I'm not getting registration. No, he's like, I'm not getting registration. Just give me the ticket, smart man. That's the type of money you got. That's how you gotta be. That's smart. That's how you have to be, bro. Because the Goons are looking for you, dog. Yeah, yeah. You gonna put me on Facebook? Don't give your location, <laughs> yo, man. Oh, I don't give my location man. nowhere. Yeah, oh, you know, I'm, I'm an enigma. There's, yeah, too, yeah. there's too many uh, fucking haters out there trying to get what you got, man. Don't don't talk about where you at partying and eating, bro, man. Just you get your money, bro, and come to your damn concerts, bro. It's too dangerous out here for that shit, bro. bro. Too up. many of... Uh, I don't know, uh, dark forces working against people who are trying to help us and shit, you know that what I mean? Right. Taking people from us like fucking Nipsey and Dolph and Biggie before they had a yeah. chance to say what they yeah. said. And that don't even just go for us, that's everybody, yeah. bro. Mm-hmm. Remember, they took Gandhi, MLK, bro. Anybody who want to make a difference, bro. You know what I mean? If you're out there with a voice, be fucking careful, yo. That includes us, but you know. We gonna be just fine, you know. We'll, we'll exercise. Well, those I don't have a million dollars in my bank account, so I'm good to go. Yeah, exactly. We ain't rich, and we'll, nobody cares. We get to exercise our amendment rights in America, I'm cause just, you know what I mean. I'm just, just going to tell curious. you, fuck you, and shoot you next. That goes one and two in America, right? When it comes yeah. to our rights, freedom of speech, and then my guns. Oh yeah, That's no, absolutely. So tough. <laughs> right? Absolutely. I get to tell you, fuck you, and blow you away over here, bro. It's fair. Well, you know, standing his ground. Yeah, yeah, I'm standing my ground. And, uh, you I ain't gonna jump about you that shit. You see the stain on my hat, bro? <laughs> Nigga, don't come to me wrong at the picnic. What you doing right there, bro? <laughs> I love that I can curse people out. I love that I can have guns. It's all great. Yo, I love America. Uh, we in a bubble over <laughs> here, and you gotta accept that the fact if you don't like it, you're kind of in a. You're, you're a weird. You're well, in a weird you like place. A I'm yeah, not saying about it. No, he's right. Yeah, I'm not saying, true. I'm saying, true. I'm not saying like, be a patriot. I'm saying you're telling me I can come bring a gun and be like, fuck you. And what's up? <laughs> At the same Let's time. Go. At the same time. I'm there. And those are my first said, Those are my first two rights in this country, bro. I get to tell you fuck you and shoot you. Like I'm an equal rights believer. Like, everybody <laughs> Listen, if I can buy a tank, you can buy a tank. That's, yeah. how, that's how I should go. Bro, don't go to Texas, bro. You know how oh stupid God. liberal oh slash conservative, oh bro, it don't make no sense. Everybody got a tank and a tiger that drives the tank. Listen, I don't have any of <laughs> But if I had them both, I would be American dream of my own. I'm Batman at that point, motherfucker. Fuck I'm you. retired Batman. I got a tank tiger, nigga. <laughs> what the fuck? Tiger. Yo, handle this, Tony. Inflicting I just, tiger. All I, really <laughs> <to> <laughs> all I want to be able to do is 
do is press a button and a trap door opens and you gotta get killed by sharks with lasers. Yes. Yo, you wow. Gold member. Yeah. I, I, you got me sharks with lasers? <laughs> oh, Freaking lasers on lasers the head. Head. Like people, people are like, what would you do with a billion dollars? A lot of stupid shit, oh, bro. bro. A billion? Would you be broke? Yes. Absolutely. Yeah. Because I would buy great white sharks and put them under my house. I want them to fight each other. Every you day. would get like the last ones known to. People are like, that. would you tell people you're a billionaire? There would be signs. I buy it. <laughs> there would like, be signs. Like on Looney Tunes? Hey, why this guy just park a tank in front of this house? I'm a billionaire. billionaire. I'm a billionaire. That's why. Try it. Fuck you, America. My first I'm ride is doing to shoot you. Shit my like second that. ride is to shoot you. I'm not doing that like that. Bro. All right, digress. But let's you get are back. crazy. I love you, news, man. <laughs> let's get back into the hippity hop of things. All right, I got a weird question because it's a thing. Okay. All right, so hip hop. All right, we know the culture. We know everything behind it, right? Right, yeah, right. Yeah. Isn't it weird when people who don't respect the culture, and I'm not talking about culture vultures. I'm mm-hmm. talking about racist. Mm-hmm. Rap. Mm-hmm. Like, there's a whole subgenre of KKK rappers. It's isn't that counterintuitive yeah, to yeah, your... Yeah, isn't that counterintuitive crazy. to your, your movement, my guy? I think yeah. that... We're taking it back for us. No, you're not. You're I know, terrible. I know exactly what happened when this happened, bro. It's reverberating. Because everything yes. black people do is cool as bro, fuck, bro. Yes, that's why. We are too cool <laughs> for them to handle. These <laughs> niggas were at a KKK meeting. Gin and Juice came on. They were like, these fucking... It's catchy, though. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> They're all like, I think we could try this out for ourselves, maybe in a few years and Give shit. Give it a hankering. Give it a little hankering it's for a so, hankering and shit. It's so bizarre. Like, There's some insane different kinds of rappers, bro. Nowadays, bro, you could be like, uh, oh my gosh, we have autistic rappers. Shout out to my autistic we have rappers, yeah. Yes, shout out to Death y'all too. Hey, oh, Blind Fury and shit. You know, nice, nice. one on six. Yeah. 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 Mad nice, mad, mad nice. nice. No, Weird. He's not that's mentally so, handicapped, though. So bl- it's, it's so bizarre. Yeah, he's, he's blind. so dope. And I'm like, how did you ever write that's anything craziness. down? Yeah, how do right. you remember? You just free. You got to be the greatest rapper of all. Am I growling everything? <laughs> do, you, do you wait? What? Can white people Hold on, write, write in braille? Do they write in braille? Fuck. Is that a thing? Oh man, what do y'all think, bro? I don't. I gotta I know. know. I don't know. You're like, oh Google shit. It, do I? Can I erase Google. the dots? Google it, bro. No, no, you can't. I gotta erase look this the dots. Up. It's just, it's He's similar. like, no, you can't erase it. It's like in the court system, like with stenographers, bro. Well, no, I get that, but like. No, but I'm saying, what do you think? Blind is blind stenographers, though, too. So if you don't think that they cannot not do it. No, no, it's yeah, not uh, saying that they can't do it, but like. Oh, uh, yeah. They, they read they, in Braille, so like, yeah. do they write in it also? They, I yeah, they'll have to. Yeah, is it like a. I like never seen Blind Fury writing, though. That's the thing. I was yeah. just. Yeah, I always thought Fury. somebody just went over it with him, bing, bing, bing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got a ghost right. Back and forth, like, literally. He's never seen him. It it is, is, he is a literal ghost to him. Yeah, a real ghost writer. He's like, Who nah, are you? like he got somebody talking to him. You know what I'm saying? Imagine COVID though. Like the blind people. This is our subject. But, like That's blind true. people during COVID is tough. Yeah. Don't yeah, touch yeah. anything. What the fuck do I do? <laughs> like in the beginning, what the fuck do I get around? Yeah, they got a blind scene. A man with them that touches stuff. Just kick Enjoy back. your COVID. Just Sorry, just same thing for you. Bro, But anyway, <laughs> I'm just saying, blind rappers like that's weird because I, I never, never see. I never. I, I don't, I don't know how. Blind I honestly fair. don't know how. To my, my 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 viewpoint is very bro. You can easily one you can easily use like Google Notes and write and yeah, that's sing into it. I think it's possible. It's that's just obvious. Great. I just, I just possible. say, yeah. But well, blind people to write yeah, braille. You know what? Thing. Yeah, if Ray Charles can play on a piano, yes. these niggas could do this. That's fair. But I don't know if they're writing braille. That was the thing yeah. that I was asking. Like, dot, dot, little yeah, dot. Yeah, like it's dot. like Morse code. How are they staying in the lines? Do they know? Because you have to fill around for it, bro. Yeah, fill For you, here's the thing. You I'm feel, just, you, you, you feel you know, what okay. braille is first. You feel what no, braille is. for sure. Is. Then I'm just saying, for me. As an artist, yeah. I think I can wrap my mind around I'm just saying, for me, if it's I just, just that's crazy. crazy. You just, you just don't yeah. end up being like, hey, I know braille. You learn it You're first. not making no, I'm just saying, it's so foreign to me. It's not like speaking another language. It's totally different. Yeah, I feel. It's just weird. It's like, what is it? If I'm wrong, sign language. I don't uh, I know some sign language. Yeah. Some. Some but, ASL? Yeah, some, but not all. No, I want to learn it. I want to learn it. Just it is don't. interesting. You ever seen them at Just the rap? Just don't use it in Cali. Getting back into hip-hop concerts. Yeah. Yo, you ever seen it in a hip-hop oh, concert? I love the translators. You ever seen the video of that? Hey, yo, like a flock of five humans over here. Yo, yo, do we have a video of a fucking, do we have a video of one of these? Uh, yo, I don't know if you guys know this. 
if you guys are hearing impaired nowadays, just like at all concerts, you can go to a rap concert and they go all they go hard, bro. Yeah, yeah I hope they get paid well. You gotta have I a assume so. You must have a conductor when you're at a hip hop concert because they say too many words, right? Yeah. So this is uh yes. Imagine somebody doing that shit to like rap god. Some of them are doing Oh <laughs> shit. <laughs> like at some point you're just like doing the Steve Carell face for fucking. I think this lady's like, the most famous one right here, uh She's Walker's, uh, she's Walker's girl. She does all the other hip-hop. She goes too hard. She goes so hard. And this one thought she was throwing up, like, gang signs are dancing at first, so this will kill me. Yeah. Yo, look at this woman go. She, she yeah. got better hand signals than rappers, yo. Yeah, she'd be good in any hood. Walker, yeah. oh my God. She all the way. Low key, guilty pleasure, Walker. <laughs> I love this fool. I don't know, bro. This fool, I just love this fool. Yo, you remember his wife, Tammy? Yo. Yeah. Oh, my. Like I'm just to be a I'm in love with this woman right here, bro. Like <laughs> she's talented, she's vibing to. She's grabbing like. my heart right now. Like, like most people, you think are just gonna sit there and sign the words. That takes some real energy. Yeah. Look yeah. at the emotion. Bro. She's a fan of the music. Yeah, she, she is. Like, yeah, she is. She's dancing and go, bro. This is dope, bro. <laughs> that that song bro. still go hard today, bro. Fuck. I go hard I in the motherfucking paint. Yeah, yeah, that's my <laughs> shit. That's my shit, bro. You guys are sure. crazy. He did it once. He didn't go hard in the paint once. I don't remember. I've yeah, never gone hard in the paint. Do you see how tall I am? Zero. I've been hard in the paint a few times. I've done it in 2K. Yeah. <laughs> he <laughs> said I did it. But in real life, oh, oh, bro, I take out all my aggressions of being short and not being good at basketball on my son. Ah, <laughs> yep, Fisher Price. He tries what? to bring that shit in. I'm like, get out. I'm like, I'm Shaq. I'll be like, what are you doing? Oh, 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 oh. Hey, bro. Oh, what's that? You want to know, know how many dads like that where I'm from in Texas built fucking world-class athletes because they weren't there? Um, They're like, you'll never be an athlete. And their son's like, I'm going to get you. <laughs> well, I, I hope he's got that extra so run because I'm going to retire. Yo, um, we hip hop in the day on DWG, yo. All man. right, here we go. I got, good, I got a good one. All right. There's people that like come into rap, you know, and, and they're not rappers, but they do rap music, right? Right. Mm-hmm. So like Jason Mraz, what's that ginger fuck's name from London? Uh, Ed Sheeran. Sheeran. Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't know his fucking name. He's bro. a ginger fuck. That shit, but yeah, he raps yeah. all the time. I always yeah, he does. Rap. Yeah, it's weird. I didn't know that. He yeah. raps. Yeah, he's, he's dope nice. too. He's, he's nice. nice. He's bro, it threw me I'm off. I'm not gonna lie. That he's not bad. <laughs> I was like, oh, let's listen to this. I was like, this this bullshit. I was like, oh shit, he's not bad. I'll take him over MGK. Yeah, all day. He disappoints me. MGK's a big disappointment, bro. He when he is. went to Eminem, uh, that it was, was like, it when he was Wild Boy, I loved him when he came out. When it was all, right after he signed Diddy, after the Wild Boy, all of us shit. loved him. All <laughs> of us loved him when he stayed in his lane. And I'm like, this when is he like, used to rap fast, yeah, now he's just yeah, yeah, he, he's, yeah. he's, a, he's a, a Midwest chopper. Yeah, he was a chopper. Yeah, and man, now he sucks. He got like, bone. He said, now he sucks. Yeah, he got bone and twist on all his songs, and like, you're I have no interest in listening to cultural culture ass. When I hear him, I'm like, ah, even your rock music sucks. Cool. Is this the actual Olympics? Yeah. Yeah, oh, why are we losing? Yeah, they they don't share this. Why are we losing? Usually. Don't share this. Oh no, this no, is no, no, this no. is this is highlights, bro. Yeah, this is highlights. Do we win? That's all I'm trying to look at. See if we won. Oh. And they're still looking at us. Wow. We're the only ones who can see. Oh, oh, <laughs> South cool, cool. Yeah, man. Yeah. I got yeah. fifteen shots. We're going to friendly game, South and Dan, and so, these niggas are giving us a tussle. This is fucking. This wild. is how the world. We won by one point. This is how the world's changing. These friendly games with us are not so friendly no more, bro. No, with everybody hates America. These niggas are coming into it. They're like, "Oh, you think you guys are cool? We have NBA players on our team now. <laughs> they play with y'all every day. We know what you do. We know y'all's tricks, bro. If America does not win the gold medal this year, oh, we're gonna be the laughing stock of the world. It will be the laughing stock, but it also won't be kind of surprising to me, bro. Okay, already. I mean, I don't care. We won one point, and if we win by a quarter mile, it's Sudan. They just showed, well, it's Sudan. They got some athletes. No, they got some athletes. I'm just saying, what are we going to do against Lithuania? LeBron was out there like, this is the fastest shit, you know, kid alive. Like, yeah, yeah, he's like, whoa. LeBron was looking at them like, he's like, that nigga jumped high. He's, <laughs> LeBron's like, oh, that was really high right there. It's like, well, damn. Michael Jordan, first person shooter, first co- or feature Kobe Bryant. I thought that said first Kobe Bryant. Yeah, man. That's the one thing I don't like about this beef. J. Cole bitched up, man. I wanted to see J. Cole catch some rap. He was smart. He was I smart. love him, smart. but yeah. I want to see what J. Cole can do, man. He can't do anything like that because he's peaceful. And I like I He's very care. conscious, overly. Again, no. the dreads. 
Yeah, yeah that's the whole trick. He yeah. turned him to a bitch. He's got good real <laughs> estate here. Straight bitch. I just want to hear you get on some bullshit, bro. I think he realized what he was doing. Okay, was his so. last one, that middle child before that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 J. Cole go hard, but like, if you're thinking about it, and Kendrick comes out and he says, you're not in my league, I'm thinking about it from what Drake did not do. J. Cole's a good lyricist. Mm -hmm. He's cool. We all like him because he's the party next door. He's relatable to us. He talks about good things, and he's very nice. But if you're going to get into beef with, like, niggas from Compton, you're not of that world, bro. I just wanted that. Uh, I didn't care. I just wanted it. Like, that diss that he released was dope. I don't think it was because it was disingenuous. It was him, disingenuous. Bro. I liked it. But I, it, it was a dope. peaceful diss. He wasn't fucking yeah, exactly. that, that He was, was burning this and fucking He was Will this nigga. He was Will Smith in yeah, I that, That's it. what I'm saying, bro. Like, Jay's too nice for that. Like, I just want to see it, bro. I want to see Will Smith diss somebody in a track. Jay's too nice. He's, he's an observationist. I'm cool with That's that. That's why but I like Jay Cole. He's an observationist. You can't be throwing nice fucking beats. I Will Smith was dissing and getting jiggy with it, bro. Because for That's a reason. What? I think that, yeah, because oh, you're he was You're basically sure. broadcasting okay. like, this is how I'm doing. I'm getting jiggy with it. I'm not worried about nothing. He was bragging about what he could do. Maybe in the talking, summertime. I think he was talking to the masses, bro. Like, man, I don't, I don't Because know, Will, man. like, if you think about it, when he came out and shit, like, what? Not when he came out when he was gay, before that. <laughs> oh, my God. But, like, when he when he was Will Smith back then, getting jiggy yeah. with it, he couldn't yeah. be touched, bro. I think he was telling people, like, I don't care what color you are, you can't fuck with me. Because all of you motherfuckers watch The Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Yeah, now you're gonna watch Men in Black, and it don't matter what I do, whether you're white or black, because that's what happened, mm -hmm. you're gonna fuck with me. That nigga went across the world and shit, and he's all, bruh, I, I don't, it looked like Michael Jackson in China, bro. When Will was getting jiggy with it, bro, it he was kind of that it was an famous. Anthem. It was an anthem. Yes, bro. He was yeah. kind of that famous. Yeah. I think he kind of was just saying, I'm going to be the biggest motherfucker right now. And I'm corny. Noriega and Jadakiss talk Nas ghostwriting for Will Smith. I'm getting jiggy with it. Wait. What? This makes so much fucking sense. Wait, 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 wait a minute. This is literally a video. Nas ghostwrite for, ghost for Will Smith. Something. Is it verified? No. But, okay, but these two dudes are literally. saying Wait, something. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. okay. Getting jiggy with the lyrics. I'll be able to tell you. You can listen to it and play. Oh, I thought you were. What did that just say about that getting white Getting jiggy with what the lyrics. What did you just fucking put on the screen? Uh, well, it's this song about White Tower. Oh, yeah. oh, okay. I just see the white Magical the action. Power. Whoa, whoa. Wow, chill. Yeah, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> chill chill chill. Is this Nas? On your mark, gritty set, let's go. Dance for the flow. You know, I know, I go psycho. No, that ain't Nas. Keep, keep, no. on, let, keep on reading the lyrics, okay. man. Right now, you're reading the surface. When my new joint hit, ooh, I just can't sit. Gotta get jiggy with it. Ooh, that's it. <laughs> that's Nas. He too gone. Nas. He too gone right okay, now. Okay, okay. Maybe that's Nas. Nas is Nas. Listen to the, listen to the content okay, of what I'm, he's I'm rapping reading. about. Come right, DKNY, all up in my eye. You got Prada bag with all the stuff. It's not as real as gotta be. It's Give it to be. your friend, let's spin. Everybody looking at me, glancing at the kid. Mm. That's a Nas verse. That's fucking they, Mark, they stay Mark glancing Silver's at the kid. That shit, yeah. <laughs> glancing at the kid, wishing they was dancing the jig. Here with the handsome kid. Sick a cigar from Cuba, Cuba. I just buy this. That's for Escobar. The oh, this is Nas. This is Nas. What the fuck? Oh, this is Nas. Once again, dog. Once again, y'all, y'all know what this boy great. Is crazy. I done told y'all, cuz. Whoa! You, you want to ball with the kid? Watch your step. You might fall. I'm trying to do what I did. Mama, uh, uh, uh. Come closer. I'm in the middle of the club with the rubber dub dub. No love for the haters. The haters mad because I got floor seats to the, the Lakers. Lakers. See me on the 50. This is not. <laughs> this is fucking not. They told me. Ali told me I'm the greatest. This is not. Bruh. Will Bruh. Smith, you faker. <laughs> we exposed you right now. Right now. And Nas, I'm, a, I'm not ashamed of you, but I'm ashamed of you for not making it for yourself. Oh, nobody would have liked it. He didn't it. need it. They would have liked it. it. Yeah, they would have liked it. Yeah, he wrote it for Will. But I wanted some of these lyrics in your song, even though he does better in his own songs. This so is again, crazy. This is not. Nice. It is, it's a diss track to some. Because I'm trying to think like, who, was who was the was hottest it? artist around that time when Getting Jiggy When He Came Out. It was a diss. And I, I can't the think of the artist, bro. Chip's looking at me like, dude, I'm trying to think. No, I'm trying to think. 
I'm because looking at the lyrics and I'm trying to think. That was pre Eminem, so yeah, we not him. Not no, him. there was no way for him to come at Eminem. But he went at, he was going at somebody. And pre, he was like, pre and Jason. Bro, I'm telling you. And what's so crazy about that? It was it was catchy. It's a great song. They it's were a great singing song. it in the churches. Yeah, they didn't drop whack shit. Yeah, okay, there. look at look at this line. Since I moved up like George and Wheezy. C R E A M is what the lyrics read to the Crazy. maximum. That's wild. wild. That's wild. I be asking them, would you like to bounce with the brother that's platinum? platinum. Uh, never see well attacking them. Why would play you, ball with Shaq and them? Why would you spell them. cream like that? This is what the official lyrics read. Like Wu Tang is Nas dissing Wu in this bitch. They had beef for a little bit, I believe, and then they were cool again. Whoa. Because they said uh, Biggie told Nas that, you know, Wu-Tang was biting well, kick, shit. Kicking the door was for yeah, Nas. Yeah, I'm yeah, on the was. songwriters, and you know Nasir Jones ain't even fucking looking well, yeah, up in here. Right. Yeah, he's ghostwriting, like so they're not. Wow. Hip-hop. Wow. <laughs> Nas, I know you wrote getting jiggy with it. Holla at your boys at DWG, but, but man. But who is it that you're exactly dissing? Because I need to find we out. We need to know. Nas, tell us who you're talking about and getting jiggy with it. I'll love you forever. I still do. But wow. Wow. Uh -huh. yeah, Hip-hop. I told you, bro. Hip-hop. Hip-hop. I told you. Yeah. Hip -hop, on that note. On that note. All right. Make sure we, you do anything you do. Man, man, do sure it with grace. grace. For sure, for sure. Later, y'all. Later. Throw it down for sure.